So we finally have Rising OS new version available. This is Rising OS based on Android 16 and this is Rising OS revived version, not the previous Rising OS, a different version, but finally based on Android 16. First look, initial version, right now it is in testing stage or you can say a preview version, so not officially available yet right now while making this video for many people, but it will be available soon. Here is the first look based on Android 16. The features, the things which are included, we will talk about everything in this video so stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end first of all if you're able to notice the default launcher is pixel launcher although we might see some other features in the terms of launchers we have this apps list option available in the pixel launcher which is a part of latest android 16. the launch is a different one launch is the same one actually so not having anything new but lock screen whenever you try to fill any pin you will see the blur background here I guess it is enabled by default, so that's good. Also, if you are looking forward to some of the features which are included, we have the sidebar feature available, which is working perfectly fine. So this is good because this is Android 16. So that is I'm showing you all the features which actually were present with Android 15 already, but because Android 16 is a new version. So getting all these features by default, it's a very good thing. We also have the cloned apps feature included in this case, which is good, which is working fine. And you can use it in case you want to. Lock screen also have few of the tweaks. For example, we have lock screen widgets already available and all of these widgets you can configure, you can customize. You can even customize a lock screen widget style. We have the big widget, we have small widget, some things, uh, some of the things are inspired from nothing OS as you can see. So that's really good. Even it brings you the support for depth wallpaper. If you want to use it, you can iOS inspired depth wallpaper. I guess some of you, the, some of the users might love this thing. Some of the users might not. And everything else is just similar. We have the now bar option, media cover art, weather update, and some of the gestures like double tap to sleep and so on. If you move on to other tweaks or customizations, it brings you boot animation customizations too. Although like Evolution XOS is already here and that is not bringing you, I mean Rising OS is not bringing you more boot animation options few of the options are available and all the icon pack options as expectedly already present I'll, i'm using plumpy icon pack and use any other in case you want to if you move on to the settings ui you will notice that you can configure the settings ui in case you want to like we have the option for android 16 style expressive rising OS style so for example i have chosen this one android 16 revamped search bar and so on and if i move on to settings ui if you're able to notice it looks good the widgets are there on the top and the left side icons are the latest ones available with Android 16's latest update available in some other custom ROMs too. For example, we have Evolution XOS, one of the examples available, Voltage OS is there and some other custom ROMs too. One of the features which is so good is regarding wallpaper blur and that is present in this case which is working fine and I'm using it on my device too. Other theming options brings you all the similar options which you are looking forward to like brightness slider customizations, signal icons, notification styles, power menu styles, progress bar style and many many more things. If you move on to other toolbox options you will notice some of the things like navigation customization it also brings you that AI assistant if you want to use it so all the features which were present previously already available in this case even all the security bypass features like hiding the developer status, hide app list, hiding the screen capture status and so on. And you can also take a backup of all these settings and you can restore them as, as you want to. Spoofing options, there are all these spoofing options present which means we have Google Photos unlimited spoofing, have the option for pixel props, also have the option for key box spoofing. So if you have any, you can easily pass strong integrity on your devices. If you move on to lock screen clock styles, you will notice all the clock styles are present here too, which also brings you the option to tweak some other fonts. And if you are into fonts, you have all the font styles available like previous ones. And you can use any one of these fonts like I'm using One UI Sans and yes, these fonts are actually good. Time to showcase the quick settings panel, which is the main highlight of course with Android 16. So as you can see, the new quick settings panel is already here, which is good. Although the good thing about this quick settings panel is 
it is giving you all the blur options and so on and yes you can change it if you are not satisfied with it you can simply disable this one and you'll be able to use the default one let me show you i have disabled this new quick settings panel and this is what we have we have some color issues but we can fix it very easily by system ui restart and some colors you can even customize a quick settings background and also have the option to choose the android 11 style quick settings panel also have the option for quick setting themes and also have the option for quick setting widgets many many customizations already present in this case so it doesn't look like that we are using android 16 it is looking like we are using android 15 but yes it is the latest android 16 so some of the features which are actually exclusive to android 16 will definitely be there in my upcoming video which i will bring you the rising west latest stable version that will be available for you soon i might i might make a video on that one too to show you some other features which are getting which you are getting but for now this is what we have if you want to give it a try as i just told you this is the initial version or maybe a preview version so right now while making this video it's not officially available for many devices it might be available later or soon but for now this is the early first look if you like this make sure to drop a like and if you are new here don't forget to subscribe to the channel we'll see you in the next one